Hello guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix when there's no compatibility option in the properties for you. As you can see, I have it. Uh, this tutorial will be quick and simple. Just make sure to subscribe to this channel and leave a like on this video if you will find this guide useful. So first of all, uh, when you uh, go ahead and open it up, you want to make sure that you are on selected file you want to open. Because for example, if I would be I would click on this one and I go here, click on properties. Sometimes it doesn't show compatibility. So just make sure, as you can see, here it is. There's no compatibility and it's because this is not exe file. This is DLL. So that might, might be the issue. So just make sure that you don't click on the, for example, just on the folder for the folder, for example, it will not be compatibility nowhere. If I would click on the DLL file, as you can see, there's also no compatibility. But if I click on EXE, it's right there. So just make sure that you have selected the, the, the correct uh, file. Now, if that wasn't the problem, you want to go ahead and go to properties and you will definitely see security options. So click on security and you want to make sure that you are either administrator or for all of the users, you want to make sure that you have allowed full control to modify, read and execute and so on and so forth. So just make sure that it is on allow to change permissions. You just need to click here and go ahead and change the permissions right there. Now, if that wasn't the problem, you want to open up a local group policy editor or edit group policy. Uh, this is how it looks like. It's going to make it bigger. Basically, you will need to go ahead and open um, administrative templates. Uh, just click on the arrow, then Windows components and find um, application compatibility. Here it is application compatibility, and then you will see remove program compatibility property page, double click on it, and just make sure that it is on not configured and click OK. Now, uh, the last thing you can try is go on in the file you want to run and click run as administrator right there. And after that, check if compatibility uh, will show up in the properties. So if this video was helpful, guys, make sure to subscribe to this channel and I will see you next time. Bye.